Hello boys and girls and welcome to Avalonia. Let us go to my magnificent snows no bounds. This is a cutscene and I will see you guys on the other side of it. Deuces! Hello, science face. That's Avalon Centrifuge to you! <laughs> hey, kiddo! Welcome to the triumphant manifestation of my transcendence. I call it home. That's enough! It's business time. Ace, the time has come for you to learn the ways of the machines. You shall become a pilot. I shall lead us to victory. And you shall be my number two. Now see here, Avalon. I am the leader of the Alliance. We've talked about this. The Negativatron may attack at any moment. Nothing is more important than defending Avalon. And Craft World? And Craft World. We must be prepared. Clive. Yes, Mr. Science? Fetch my tall orange macchino. I've got brain thinking to do. Oh. Hello, guys. That was a pretty cool cutscene. I always liked that guy. He is a cool baller guy with an epic voice. That's all I like about him is epic voice. So, let us continue on our way. We are going to start with showing you that this sticker right here, there is something over there. I wonder what the fuck that is. Um, so, let us get these two costumes over here. We have uh, these two, this one guy and a girl. One's a photo guy, and the other one, I don't know, I never used a costume, I don't care for it. Right now, I am a classic carrot on a stick with a dragon face and sleepy eyes and a bunch of stuff. It's pretty cool, you know, just a random costume that I made myself. Uh, not one of the randomized buttons, though. Those are fun sometimes. You keep hitting randomized till you get a good one. Uh, here is the use of vehicles and the use of killing yourself through those vehicles. Let us continue. So you press X to jump with these bunnies. The longer you hold it, the higher they jump. And we will continue and we will get the prizes. Uh, this mission, I'm not going to lie, you probably don't need me for. Very, very simple. Uh, all, the bot all the little guys are pretty much in direct plain sight. Uh, there's only a few I think that might be out of the way, but pretty much everything is in plain view. Uh, you want to make sure your rabbits don't uh, get hurt too much, because that can be quite a nuisance, especially when uh, you want to try and ace this level. So here are the only two that might be hidden. Uh, this one obviously is not hidden, but uh, fuck. So we both died, let's go skip over this part and see you back where we said we're going to go find some prizes. Okay, so now that we're here... All you gotta do is do a little bounce up to this uh, kind of thing over here. You can jump off that. Jump on these cans. Oh shit, I missed the jump. But jump on those cans and uh, then you get all the way up to that thingamajig. There's a one uh, prize bubble in the sky. Loose prize bubbles in the sky with diamonds. I can't do parodies very well. I always try to do them whenever I think of a word. But uh, there we go. We got the prize bubble. Let us continue on our way. So each of the uh, checkpoints gives you full hearts again. Um, that's always helpful because there's plenty of parts where you get electrocuted and your little bunny rabbit goes hurts. Um, this triangle is fairly easy to get, but if you miss it, that's not going to be good. Uh, there's there's a good. Um, after this, this part can be quite challenging, especially with two people because it's such a confined area, but I usually find my way up there pretty easily. 
but my friend has the hardest time in the world. So enjoy his problems. He has a lot of problems. He's like, I don't know which way to go. Da, da, doing do, doing do, doing do. That's the sound he makes when he bounces because he thinks he has to make the sound effect for it to work. But uh, apparently he's Neo from the Matrix and he can jump off walls and fly through the air like nobody else can. Uh, even though he can't figure shit out. Alright, he pushed me into that one, that's lovely. But uh, here's the part where you have to control your jump. So, tapping X will give you a shorter jump. Um, with these two prizes here. Uh, and so tapping X will get you under those things, that's pretty decent. And then, after that, we gotta use these little bouncy things to go one, two, three, and four. So we get to the top, my friend has more trouble. That's laughable. We can just laugh at him. Oh, there's a prize over there. We're not going to miss it at all because we're awesome like that. Oh, shit. Interception. Oh, my God. Interception. Touchdown. He wins the game. All right, so here is the first enemies of the level. Uh, you don't need to bounce off them to get the decorations, but they are fun to smash. So you, when you jump up, you press R1 for your slam attack, and that is a devastating attack that will rape anybody's face. Uh, these ones, however, you do I think you do have to jump off their heads to get these prize levels. So, good luck to you. It's not very difficult. Continue on your journey. So going back to my interception over there, who do you guys think is going to win the Super Bowl this year? Uh, if you have, if it's your favorite team in the Super Bowl, you are lucky as shit if they're still in the finals. Um, because a lot of the favorites got eliminated this year pretty, pretty, pretty early in the, uh, in the second postseason. Is that what it's called? No, postseason is after the season in the, is it still called? Whatever the fuck it's called, I don't give a shit. Um, so, yeah, so who is who are you rooting for for the Super Bowl? Even if it's not your home team, uh, even if it's not your favorite team, because I know obviously some people can't have home teams if they're in Canada, like moi, and if they're in like Europe, like some of my friends. But uh, that's life. Regardless of these things, I just would like to know who you are picking for the Super Bowl. That is all. Um, there are several prizes along the way down here, so just get those. One and a two, and then a trois. So that's cool beans. Uh, then after this, there is three new guys, but they are electrocuted guys, so watch the fuck out or else you might get hurt. Uh, there's four prize bubbles in the air. Five prize bubbles in the air. I can't even count now. That's how tired I am. Why do we always do these late at night? Oh yeah, because I have school all the time and I work all the time. It's fucking bullshit. I never have free time to play with a big planet. And when I do, I have video problems. It's ugh, so angry. Whatever. I'm doing it right now. You guys are going to watch more videos. And we will have a fun time doing it. Um, now this mission, it uh, it seems quite long. But it's actually really, 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 really fun to play. Because you get all these different vehicles. So here, greetings once more. You've made it to stage 2 of Avalon's training something I didn't read fast enough. Um, so you pull this one. And the one you get this time is a doggy dog, the doggy tank. And uh, the doggy tank is a very, very cool ride. Uh, it scuffles back and forth and has a little bit of a jump. Uh, his sonic bark maneuver, however, knocks blocks down out of the way. So if you have an obstacle in your way, just smash it out of the way. Uh, here, Here's an example of using it in a puzzle where you move out of the way, and then once you go down again, you'll push it back down again. So not too difficult, but uh, they're going to get more and more difficult as we progress. That's usually how games should work. If they don't do that, then they're failures of games. So above these two are two prize bubbles, but they're impossible to... Oh, three prize bubbles. See, again, I keep fucking up the numbers. Oh, well. Um, they're impossible to miss. If you do somehow miss it, I have I have uh, very low, very low uh, regard for you anymore. I have very low respect. So this one here, this one is not difficult. Uh, what you gotta do is, you don't have to do that super maneuver, but what you gotta do is push this, fuck, watch out, push that off. You can do it to the right so that you don't have to worry about it later, but you jump onto the platform and then you push these two to the side with your electric bolts. And what that'll do is that'll open you up for a super jump all the way over to the right. So let's see if we can do it. Go! Oh, that didn't work. But me, it worked for me because I'm the baller and my friend sucks at this game. Uh, this part is quite challenging, and by quite challenging I mean just annoying because these guys wave their flailing dicks around like fucking a pedophile at fucking the zoo. He's just like, mm -hmm, look at me, yes, yes. 
That's very inappropriate, guys. Let us continue. So what I have decided to do is anybody that wants to be my friend on the PSN can add me. My name, if you have not seen it before, is Refenway, R-E-F-E-N-W-E. If you add me and say um, I'm subscribed to you and you give me your name as a subscriber, I will definitely add you as a friend. Or if you want to do the reverse and you subscribe and say, hey, I want to add you, but I don't, uh, I don't know how to spell Refenway, even though you spelt it for me. I'm just too lazy to go through all the trouble of going back in that one video and saying, hmm, when did he say it? It was exactly 1024.032111, binary code 10. Um, you can just say, hey, can you add me? And then I'll, I'll add you if you give me your ID. Uh, a couple of guys, I think three guys have already added me, and I'm looking forward to playing with them. Unfortunately, I've not had the opportunity yet, but I'm sure the time will come soon. Uh, here we go to hop into the last obstacle thing, not obstacle thing, the last elevator thing, and we will be going to the last, last, last vehicle of this level, my favorite vehicle of, of this level, the hamster wheel. So the hamster wheel is the coolest thing that's ever happened to this game. So look at this guy. He's not only the fastest thing in the game, but he is so cool. Look at him. So he gives a boost with R1, jump a pretty big jump with X, and he will get you a huge combo. Let's see how it goes. Times two. All right, we're building it up. Let's go. Times, okay, we lost our combo. Let's go. Let's build a new one. All right, we're already almost beating the combo. Yes, we got times three going on. Okay, we lost it. Um, we are losers of this game, but that's okay. We do our best to be losers. That's what we try to do. So we're technically succeeding. Don't even worry about it. Times four. See, look, now we're winning. There's two prize bubbles here, so you gotta get those. Screw combos when you get fucking prize bubbles. Three prize bubbles. Oh, yeah. Let us continue. Oh, God. I think the house is exploding. But let us continue anyways. So here is three prize bubbles and a challenge key. Uh, for some reason, this challenge key is, like, hating me. It's like, no. No. And... No. Okay, yeah, it said, it said yes that time, but still, it's not very happy with me. That time, I kind of took advantage of it and stole it. Uh, this part, you can kind of glide over. Uh, there's little prize bubbles in the air. Uh, what I found is you can boost as many times as you want. You can stay in the air like flying. It's basically a flying machine. So there's four in these four rooms over here. These three rooms. Um, oh my god, another room with three more. See, I'm just like, it's this room is chock full of prizes, and they're so hard to miss. But uh, that is the last one right there, and now we've got 100%. Uh, after this, I'll go show you the prizes for acing the level. It's not too hard, just to take care with the electricity. Uh, if this video helped you out at all, even though it's a very, very simple, easy mission, uh, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more 100% walkthroughs of even the harder missions, I promise I do every single one. Uh, I will uh, just, if you want to see those, please subscribe. I will keep on making these videos, and I'm posting three or four tonight, so enjoy that, guys. 100% uh, wins us a cotton ball cloud and a triangular speaker. Also, Robobun. And let me just show you what the ace prizes are. Other than that, I will see you guys in the future. I hope you guys have a super good night, slash day, slash whatever time it is, whatever you are, slash goodbye, guys. Consecrated boots, consecrated torso, and man at work.